a sweet science to boxing the there's a sweet science to boxing the The best and the coolest thing about my career is called the sweet science. There's a sweet science to boxing the It's to hit and not get hit. Let's get to it. So look, man, y'all got to stop sleeping on Frank Martin, man. As this fight get closer and closer to the date, everybody just sleeping on Frank Martin. And you guys seem to forget who Frank Martin is. I know somebody going to say, he ain't nobody. He ain't accomplished nothing, bro. He a 30-year-old prospect. Okay, it is what it is. You still know that he's a great boxer, right? You still have seen him fight, right? You have seen this guy box, right? I mean, in my opinion, his skill seems to be more polished than Tanks when it comes to his boxing skills. So maybe he's a better boxer than Tank. I'm talking about his foot placement. I'm talking about his defense. I'm talking about his little traps that he said. And even Frank Martin said it himself. He said, y'all better stop sleeping on him. Check out this clip on his interview that he had with Cigar Talk. Everybody got to realize he in there with me too. Mm. You know, I'm just, people sleeping on me. He in there with me too. You know, like, when we get in there, he going to respect what, what I'm bringing. Yeah. You know, it ain't just going to be he finna come through and just and, and just push a nigga over. I yeah. ain't going. Right. You know, I ain't going. He definitely got a point. Y'all got to understand that Tank is in there with him as well. It ain't like Tank is in there with some type of bum. Y'all think that Ryan Garcia was a threat? Frank Martin is going to be a real threat. Somebody who can actually box. Somebody who ain't depending on one left hook. And y'all actually had Ryan Garcia being a threat. Y'all had him being a real threat to Tank Davis. Yeah, but this is Frank Martin. This is a matter who's definitely going to be a real threat to Tank Davis. I put him on the level as Isaac Cruz type of competition for Tank. I'm not saying that it's going to be close. I'm not saying that Tank is going to knock him out. I'm just saying I think it's going to be pretty hard for him to knock this guy out. Oh, I feel that there could be a chance that Frank Martin could win this fight. Because, you know, like Frank Martin said, Tank do lose early rounds. If you just watch Tank fight, you'll realize he do lose a lot of early rounds because he knows that he's going to start throwing bombs at the second end of the fight and one of those bombs going to land and he's going to knock you out. But with Frank Martin, we'll know if it's going to be the case, man. Tank will not be able to take any risks versus Frank Martin. He ain't going to be able to lose any rounds because if he don't knock Frank out, Frank Martin will end up winning that fight by unanimous decision. So I agree with Frank Martin. Y'all better not sleep on him, and y'all better realize he's not only in there with Tank, but Tank is also in there with him.